Hi everybody, Belinda here. Um, hmm. Well, I think today I'm going to be trying this blowout thing, flower thing. Now I don't have the correct blower thing, I thought I had one, but I have this. I am not too sure if it's going to work, and if it doesn't work then I guess I'm going to be using the Artist Breath. So the colours I'm using is yellow, dark green, purple, and this beautiful colour is turquoise and white. So let's see how that goes. So I don't have the house paint. Well, I do actually have the house paint, but I really am not interested in using it because my in my experience in the past with the house paint it has cracked when it's dried and it's the only time I've ever had or experienced any form of cracking of my paint so <coughs> I'm just going to wing it and see what happens and if it works then nobody needs to use house paint right So this is just normal titanium white and Floetrol, mixed pretty thick. And I think I'm going to go in with, hmm, actually I might use the blue first. sure how much paint I'm supposed to be using to tell you the truth maybe I should have gone in with the yellow first uh, anyway we are here at this point now and then I'll put some yellow none of my paints have silicone at this moment Right, so <coughs> this here is Floetrol Titanium White and the Liquitex Basics Pouring Medium and Varnish. And I have not mixed it according to how everybody else does. I am just doing my own thing. Let's see. Oh, there's some cells popping up. Interesting. And of course my torch is having a little drama of its own lately. Ever since I changed the brand of my butane. There we go. It's having its own little heffy fit. Oh, his foot. So let's see if this works if I blow it out. No, not enough force. No. Okay, well, here goes then. Hopefully I'll keep you on the screen. I don't like blowing. My lungs don't <laughs> have much capacity. Wow, that's a big blow. Whew, I'm dizzy. And that is what I was trying to avoid was the dizziness. Okay, so let's put... Oh, which one's which? Um... might be actually turn out very pretty it's looking pretty it's actually looking beautiful Hmm. 
It really is looking really, very pretty. So I'm trying not to lose that little purple bit in the center. I might end up losing it. Oh, wow. That is gorgeous. Let's get some of this paint moving. I don't want to me I don't want to lose too much of what I have. actually looking really pretty. I like it. So I went out this morning and I actually literally got back just now and um, the wind is so so bad. I was <laughs> I was trying desperately to hold on to my skirt and um, my hair was blowing in my face and my skirt was blowing up above my knees and I had a I have a very flowy like lacy <laughs> very light material chiffon like top and that of course was flying around and I'm just like oh my word how embarrassing is that <laughs> But anyway, I survived. And then on my way back to the car after buying my products, um, it started raining cats and dogs. So I then got caught in the rain. Oh, yeah, like one of the subscribers had said to me, um, <coughs> the birds seem to be my signature. Thing. And even though this is a flower, there's a bird. It's so crazy. I don't understand why. Okay. Let's just touch up the sides. I'm going to give this another torch and then I'm going to bring you guys in to have a look. And remembering, I have not used the paints that are being used currently by everybody else on all the products and the paints and everything so if you want to create this effect and you don't want to go and spend all that extra money just to get that effect, this effect you don't need to okay guys I'm going to give this a torch and then I'll bring you in to see this beauty. And then you guys, I'd like you to comment below. What do you think? What kind of flower you think it looks like? I do love it. <coughs> There's some beautiful cell action going on in there. Watch all of those bubbles. Wow. So I am going to be doing a couple of other different things as well. You know me, I mean? love different. And um, the reason being also is because you know, I have that craft fair coming up in February. I don't know if that's a hair or bubbles in a row. And, you know, I want to be able to sell some, not only my artwork, but um, some functional art. I do have a couple of pieces of functional art, which um, I can show you in another video. Come on, torch. What's up? 
Okay, well maybe it doesn't want to be torched anymore. Right guys, so if I can try and avoid this light a little bit and um, before I switch it off and show you more you have a look here, it looks like a bit of a kind of like a beautiful swan but needless to say um, all this beautiful beautiful lacing all that lacing over there, that yellow lacing and all these cells, the cells Colourful cells within colourful cells. It's beautiful. Okay, I'm going to put the light off. Yeah, it's gorgeous. So guys, that's um, no silicone, no house paint, and... Um, Yeah, none of the amazing products that people are, are all rushing out to buy. And I think that's beautiful. What a successful little pour. Well, guys, thank you very much again for watching. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye.